Shake it, shake it, shake it. This is a very uh, mellow ride. Uh, Height has a brand new KTM 300, and I am just my first ride after breaking bones in both hands and my wrists. Uh, it's my first ride back since December. So we're going to take it real easy, stick to the main trails, and go mellow, and not do a whole lot that's exciting. So this may be a pretty boring video for people watching. Because the first uh, 100 yards of dirt the hike the bike's ever been on. The built-in uh, thermometer temperature gauge I've got seems to think that it's 61 degrees, but it sure didn't feel like it, especially when we're doing 30 miles an hour down the hall roads. But it was a nice day. It was sunny, high clouds. Dry, so you know, good stuff. We're turning on to Greenbury Road, which is the main uh, east west highway in Darkwater, coming up to the old uh, Greenbury Road drag line, which looks like it's been uh, abandoned for a decade or more, at least in, not in use for a decade or more. Up to the poop circle! Well, the poop circle rocks are not terrible. Here I'm looking at the uh, condition of that trail going up into the woods. It doesn't look too scary, but it's uh, enough of a challenge to we'll skip it today. Try it again maybe in a week or two. Do the gate bypass. We got a bit of a late start today because we had to stop by the FRO office to get my permit for the year. Uh, a pretty good deal, you get to ride all over their land once you pay the fee. And of course sign a liability release, which is probably the most important thing for them. This is a new trail that I think is mellow. I, do, I remember it as being rocky, but we'll find out what it's like as we ride up it. Looks fairly freshly cut, or at least a lot of uh, saplings and things have been chopped down on it. A lot of uh, snow melts, so uh, a lot of mud. It's pretty slick. A lot of puddles. We're going to take a couple hundred yards on this pavement here, which is actually the street, at least an official county name of Thomaston Road. Uh, we'll take that down and then hang the left and get back onto the uh, gravel roads. This is climbing up to the Marion drag line. It's a new modern electric drag line that was in use uh, maybe a year, two years ago according to the guys that contacted the FRO. Very fancy machine and kind of big. That's a normal sized car right in front of us. Uh, It sure doesn't feel like it's 48 uh, when you're blasting down the trail here.
Here we're going to climb up to the secret path to hide secret trail up into the woods. We won't take the full trail, but this will give him a little chance to uh, climb some some hills and it'll stretch the legs on the on this 300 a little bit. Snow is gone from most of the open areas, but uh, you can see on the no, no, no. sides of the base to the west, uh, there's still a fair amount of snow on the ground. This is a little easier if you go attack it with a little bit more speed. But it's not a problem. So this is what you had all along. What's that? This, this is what you had all along. Yeah. That's really sweet. Oh, they're sweet up the hill. <laughs> they are sweet up the hill. <laughs> That's amazing. Okay, now that is a nice little 300 hill. Yeah. So we want to go down here and put around a little bit? Yeah. I'm not sure where here is, but it looks like a good puttering place. Yep. <laughs> There's Heights, a uh, brand new 300. On it. Starting to make it look like a real motorcycle. You need more speed for that. Now he calls that a drop, but boy, that really wasn't much of a drop. He just went away out of this. It's a nice view of the captive pond, lake, whatever it is. It's taller, man. <sighs> Fisher Hill. Huh? Fisher Hill. Oh, Fisher Hill. Fisher Hill. There's three giant fishers in the ground that want to swallow you up. Oh. So let's go up and hang a right and go along that ridge and see if we can see back towards the pond.
now we're exploring the trail to see if we can uh, find the other end of the pond and perhaps see a, a way to get down to it. Was an easy trail. I thought it was steep. I thought it was steep and short. Dude, it's as long as the pond. Yeah. yeah. I don't think you can get to the entrance from this route. Can't get there from here, huh? Right. I'm pretty sure I've not ridden this tr section of trails before, so we're gonna take it easy. Does that go anywhere? No, 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 no. Not today. I wasn't in the mood to go down that uh, steep rocky hill, so we're just heading back up the hall road. First up to the uh, Marion red line, and then we'll end up heading back to the car. see this thing up. The height's on the gas pretty hard here, and he's throwing up a monstrous root, roots to uh, rocks and dirt and stuff lying up and smack me in the head. It doesn't show up on the video, but it's for real though. And also here, which is uh, you can see the dust that he's taken up. So I'm letting him get a little bit ahead so I don't have to fight all the all the dirt dirt and dust he's throwing up. And here we are, back at the car. Successful little mellow ride.